So a lot of you have uh, camped out maybe for football game tickets, music festival tickets, shoes even, sure. iPhones, anything Apple comes up with. We've seen all that before. What about pottery? Yeah, people are so excited for the reopening of Hadley Pottery in Butchertown that they're lined up for it. WHS 11's Connor Steffen is there. Connor, uh, how cool is it to see this kind of support for a local business? Haley, it's not just cool to see, but to hear the personal stories of how this iconic Louisville business has made people's lives. You really just can't put it into words. The same can be said about the reaction people had back in March when the store first announced it was closing after 80 plus years of being open. The store's most recent owner, Jerry Day, said Hadley took in eight months worth of orders in the span of four days, so they had to shut down machines. But fortunately for so many here, the store has opened once again, and that's under the new owner, Brooke Smith, who said he's going to invest millions into the business in the coming year. But that also brings us to here today in this line. You have people from, uh, I know, New Mexico, from Michigan, and we have Randy and his wife, and they're from Texas, 900 mile drive. Yes. Tell me, why did you choose to make the trek out here today? Because I love my wife. Uh, she's from Kentucky and she's had Hadley uh, for her, her entire life. And um, we heard it was shutting down and she said, let's go. And we came last month and came out here and waited from six o'clock on. And she said, let's go again because we may not be able to make it back. And halfway here, we got the email that they were going to reopen and she said, do you want to turn around? I said, no, let's go. So yeah, right. Well, I'm, I'm sure that's great news for you guys. Right. Um, and just can you put into words? I know it's your wife who's from Kentucky, but what does it mean to have? Because it's more than just a dish or yeah. Yeah. Uh, explain. Well, it's it's a memory. It's, you know, maybe where were we when we got this or what it, what it can do for our kids. It's just part of growing up in Kentucky. I mean, Hadley's been here for 80 years mm -hmm. and so it's not just a dish or a plate or a cup it's maybe it's a story or maybe it's something that our kids can share with their kids yeah. and you know it's more than pottery absolutely it's more than pottery thank you guys yes, so much we'll be sure to have more we're going to be camped out here alongside the people we'll have more at whas 11 at noon and throughout the afternoon but for right now live in louisville connor stefan whas 11 on your side